In today's video, we are going to learn how to generate the APK file and the app bundle file that you can publish on your Play Store. Alright, so now I'm going to click on Build. I will navigate to Flutter under Build. Alright, so first we are going to start by building the APK file. Next, we are going to learn how to build the app bundle. All right, so now I'm going to click on Build APK. So we are going to wait patiently for this APK file to be generated. Once the APK file has been built and generated, I'm going to show you um, where to locate the APK file. So for the APK file, you can always, you know, um, send it to your phone and uh, install it from there and then test it. But for you to publish on your Play Store, you're going to need the app bundle. So now the APK file has been generated. So I'm going to show you where to locate this file. All right, so now we have a, a file path, the, the build path. Okay, so the file is inside uh, the build folder. APK file is inside this path. All right, so build app output, flutter app, and then app release.apk. Where to locate the, the APK file that has been um, generated for us. So I'm going to click on build. I'm going to expand up and then I'm going to scroll down a little bit. Then I'm going to click on output and then I'm going to click on um, Flutter APK. That's where the file is. Uh, let's see. Okay. Debug. All right. So it's inside this part. So what we are going to do right now is that uh, let me take you to my file explorer. Let's see if we can get it from there. I'm going to open this. All right. So wherever you save your your um, project, so you, you're just going to locate that place. So let's take for instance, I have this. Okay, so inside this, my project, I'm going to open build. And then inside the build folder, I'm going to open app. Inside the app folder, I'm going to look for outputs and open it. Inside the output folder, I'm going to open Flutter app or Flutter APK. All right, so now this is the release version of the apk file so if you need the debug version you can you know um get it from here okay so but this is the release version so i will advise you to you know transfer this to your phone install it and then you're going to test your app from there to see how it works okay so now let's go back i'm going to show you how to generate your app bundle Remember, I told you that your app bundle is what you need to publish on your Play Store. Okay, all right. So this guy has been able to. Um, remember, I actually tried to expand this to show you from here. We had to locate the um, generated APK, but this um, young man right here wasn't ready. So I'm going to click here. All right, so this is what I, was, I tried to show you before. So this is the, the release version of the APK. And then this is the debug version of the APK. All right, so you can also get it from your file explorer. So let's see um, if we can locate it from here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so you actually know where you um, save your project just the way I have shown you here. Yeah? 
So just go ahead and you know get the file from your Flutter dash APK folder. All right. So now we are going to learn how to um generate the app bundle. Remember, the app bundle is what you need to publish in your Play Store. Um, you don't actually need um the APK file anymore. The app bundle is what you need to publish um on your Play Store. So now we are going to learn how to generate the app bundle. All right. So now we are going to click on build. We are going to navigate to Flutter. Then from Flutter, we are going to click on build app bundle. All right. So um, we are going to wait for it to generate the app bundle, just as you see here in your terminal okay so within 9.8 seconds the app bundle has been um, generated all right so you see the file ex extension um, is different um, the dot aab is a file extension for app bundle once you see this it means that this is the um, app bundle version of your app all right, so this is what you need to publish on your Play Store. This right there is what you need to publish on your Play Store. But the first one we generated, that one is for testing purpose. You can, you know, um, send it to your phone, install it from there, and then, you know, test the app to see how um, it works before you go ahead to uh, publish the app bundle. On your Play Store. So for you to do that, you need a Google, uh, um, a Play Console developer account. All right. So in my next video, I'm going to show you how to publish app on, um, on Play Store. All right. Okay. So now I'm going to show you where to locate this file. Um, the file is inside Build, App, Output, Bundle, Release, and then this is a file so we are, we are going to follow the same format i'm going to go back here one time and then we are going to go back like this um we are going to go back to okay build this is build then we have um let's see build app okay that is app then we have output okay so from output we have um we have bundle do we have it here okay so from here it's not ready we are going to you know again go back one time to our file explorer so from our file explorer we are going to go into the root directory of the um, project and then we are going to open build and then from build we are going to open up and then from app, we are going to look for output. And then from output, we are going to open bundle. And then from bundle, we are going to open release. And then here is your app. Um, here is the release version of your app bundle. So this is the file that you need to publish on your or to up upload on your um google play store developer account all right so this is what you need you don't need the dot apk file anymore all right so if you follow closely in our previous video you will discover that we use android studio and flutter for this project so what we did in this video is to generate app bundle and apk file so thank you so much for watching I'm going to stop it for now. Goodbye.